Hello everybody, Travis Chandler, Chandler Gaming, back here with the next episode of Mass Effect 2. Before we get in the video, be sure to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on those notifications so you can be notified of all my videos. That being said, let's get down to it. Okay, so the last episode, we went and got the Convict Jack and the, um, attempted to get the Krogan Warlord, but we ended up getting his, um, getting his project instead. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Not at the moment. Think I've unlocked collector interest in humans. Wait, no. Only one heart. Krogan have two. Scratch that. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Okay, so nobody wants to talk, I don't think, and so... The elusive man wishes to speak to you in the debriefing room, Commander. Is it true we have a pod containing a baby Krogan down in the cargo hold? Not a baby. He's a full-grown super soldier, ready for combat. Please be careful if you decide to birth him. His personality is completely unknown. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? That'll be all. It's always nice chatting with you. Okay. We're going up to the cabin first. I need to feed the fish. There we go. Going down here so we can deal with the Krogan pod. Which is over here. Subject is stable, Shepard. Integration with onboard systems was seamless. Can he see anything in there? Does he know where he is? Unlikely. Current neural patterns indicate minimal cognition. Barring shipwide power loss, the nutrients in the tank could sustain him for over a year. Any idea how dangerous this guy is? He is a Krogan, Shepard. If you were asking whether he is actively hostile, I don't have the necessary data to answer. Okir's technology could impart data, not methods of thinking. The subject may know of his views, but would not necessarily share them. What can you tell me about this guy? Anything unusual? The subject is an exceptional example of the Krogan species, with fully formed primary, secondary, and tertiary organs where applicable. No defects of any kind, aside from the genetic markers of the genophage present in all Krogan. I cannot judge mental functioning. Stand by. I'm going to open the tank and let him out. Cerberus protocol is very clear regarding untested alien technology. He's either a powerful addition to the crew or a time bomb. I'd rather deal with it now. Very well, Shepard. The controls are online. The switch and consequences are yours. I'm Commander Shepard, and I don't take threats lightly. I suggest you relax. Not your name. Mine. I'm trained. I know things. But the tank, Okir couldn't implant connection. His words are hollow. Warlord, legacy, Grunt. Grunt. Grunt was among the last. It has no meaning. It'll do. I am Grunt. 
If you are worthy of your command, prove your strength and try to destroy me. You wouldn't prefer Okir? Or Legacy? It's short. Matches the training in my blood. The other words are big things I don't feel. Maybe they fit your mouth better. I feel nothing for Okir's clan or his enemies. I'll do what I'm bred to do. Fight and determine the strongest. But his imprint has failed. Without a reason that's mine, one fight is as good as any other. Might as well start with you. I have a good ship and a strong crew. A strong clan. You'd make it stronger. If you're weak and choose weak enemies, I'll have to kill you. Our enemies are worthy. No doubt about that. Hmm. Hmm. That's... acceptable. I'll fight for you. I'm glad you saw reason. Huh? <laughs> Offer one hand, but arm the other. Why, Shepard? If I find a clan, if I find what I... I want, I will be honored to eventually pit them against you. Okay. So now we need to go talk to the elusive man. I don't know what to feel about Grunt. My psych reports were for Oak here. We have no guarantees that Grunt is mentally stable. I get the feeling he just doesn't care about anything, including who lives or dies. Don't worry, Kelly. I wouldn't let him touch you. If there's any touching being done, you'd better be involved. Anyway, what's up? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Okay. The elusive man's like, oh my god, you awakened the Krogan. Um... I don't really agree with it, but you're in charge. That's pretty much what he said. Okay, so now we come talk to the elusive man here in the briefing room. Shepard. I think we have them. Horizon, one of our colonies in the Terminus systems, just went silent. If it isn't under attack, it soon will be. Has Morton delivered the countermeasure for the Seeker Swarms? Not yet. Let's hope he works well under pressure. There's something else you should know. One of your former crew, Ashley Williams. She's stationed on Horizon. Last I knew, Ash was Alliance. Why is she out in the Terminus systems? Officially, it's an outreach program to improve Alliance relation with the colonies. But they're up to something. And if they sent Chief Williams, it must be big. Perhaps you should take it up with her. The Collectors just happened to pick a colony with one of my former crew? I don't buy it. It shouldn't be a surprise the Collectors are interested in you. Especially if they're working for the Reapers. They might be going after her to get to you. We should send a message to the Citadel. The Alliance can give us reinforcements. Not until you investigate. I don't want the Alliance getting in our way. Once you have the situation under control, I'll send the message personally. Send the coordinates. We'll head straight there. This is the most warning we've ever had, Shepard. Good luck. Joker, set a course for Horizon. I've got to go see the Professor. Tell me you have something. Yes. So here we go on Horizon. Lilith, 
Lith, we've got a problem. Still can't calibrate the targeting matrix? Those defense towers are useless if we don't figure it out. Sorry, Chief. Getting our comm systems back online takes priority. Yeah. Okay. Surprised people haven't tried to blame that one on me, too. People out here don't trust the Alliance. It's nothing personal. What is that? Get everyone to the safe house. I'll cover you. Run! Okay, so we're gonna bring Garrus, and we're gonna bring Warden. Why? Because I feel like it. Swarms? Certainty impossible, but in limited numbers, should confused detection make us invisible to swarms? In theory. In theory? That sounds promising. Experimental technology only tests its contact with seeker swarms. The test of person should be accepted. <laughs> There we go. Take care of the collectors. I don't think there's anything else here except for ammo. Okay. You'd think there'd be stuff in that, in those, um, breakable crates, but there isn't. Collect 
sector ship disrupting communications. We're on our own now. There you go. Those things look like the husks the Geth used on Eden Prime. I thought the Geth got that technology from Sovereign. Elusive Man was right. Collectors working with Reapers. There it is. I want the credits. That's why I look for those data pads and stuff like that. Heavy skin weave. We'll take that. That gives Shepard uh, more health. Mm. Husks have human characteristics, possibly repurposed colonists. No, the Geth impaled their victims on giant spikes to turn them into husks. But we haven't seen any. The collectors must have already had the husks. They want the colonists alive for something else. These aren't the same creatures I fought on Eden Prime. They're more advanced, evolved. They still die if you shoot them. The collectors aren't getting away with more victims. Let's move out. Let's go. Mm, All these yeah. empty buildings. It's unsettling. No signs of resistance. Must have happened quickly. <laughs> Take that. Let them take care of it, whatever it is. There it is. Knew there was something in here. conscious, fully aware, trapped in stasis. Fascinating. They've been like this a long time. Right? All this just for a computer to hack. that particle beam we need it
There we go. All right. Because that particle beam is going to be very useful here later. Okay, we're in a bad spot here. Direct intervention is necessary. Assuming direct control. This hurts you. The forces of the universe bend to me. Focus on Shepard. You cannot resist. That all of them? Yeah, it looks like all of them. All right. That all? Yeah, that's all was in there. Just those power cells. Okay. That was not the greatest firefight. I'll tell you that right now. in Alliance space. No, oh, they got Lilith. I, I saw her go down. Sten, too. They, they got damn near everybody. What's your name? What do you do here? Name's Delan. Mechanic. I came down to check on the main grid after we lost our comm signals. And I heard screaming. I looked outside and there were swarms of bugs. Everyone they touched just froze. I, I, I sealed the doors. Damn it, it, it's the Alliance's fault. They stationed at Chief Williams here and built those defense towers. It made us a target. If you have defenses, we can use them against the collector ship. You'd need to calibrate the targeting system first. It's never worked right. Shouldn't be hard to figure out. Just need the location. Head for the main transmitter on the other side of the colony. Pretty hard to miss. The targeting controls are at the base. You know this colony and the equipment. You better come with us. Not a chance in hell. You'd probably just get in the way. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, too. I'll let you out, but I'm locking the door behind you. I'm not taking any chances. Good luck. I think you're gonna need it. Yeah, I really don't blame you, bro. Do I need the resources? No, but I'm gonna take them anyway. Ignore the 
explosive shot ready. Got his ass, there we go. Should burn nicely. They didn't drop any ammo. Drives me nuts. They know you need ammo. They know you, you know. Jesus. I mean, they know you need ammo, but why don't they drop it? Oh, they did drop ammo. Okay. This is valuable. Nautic damage. We'll take that. It's odd we haven't run across more frozen colonists. Colonists loaded onto ship. Collectors nearly finished here. Need to hurry. Oh, we'll hurry as soon as we look at everything. You know what? What gives me... What's to worry about? Uh, thank you, Garrus. There we go. Normandy, do you copy? Joker here. Signal's weak, Commander, but we got you. Edie, can you get the colony's defense towers online? 
Errors in the calibration software are easily rectified, but it will take time to bring the towers to full power. I recommend a defensive posture. I will not be able to mask the increased generator output. Collectors will respond with force to stop it. Got any other helpful tips? Just one. Enemy reinforcements are closing in. I suggest you ready weapons. Oh, I thought you had to have somebody work on them. I know you feel this. The forces of the I'm universe bend to me. Yes, you are taking fire. Reinforcements likely. But we'll get in the truck so we don't they don't get behind me. Sequential that way then I can initiated. Guardian anti ship batteries at forty percent. Reinforcements. It's nice to be noticed. Ugh. I get him? No, I didn't. Seeking targeting protocols to Normandy systems. Continue to protect the tower. Added scope. Okay, so here comes the big guardian here, or whatever they call this. There we go. That's why you use the particle rifle here. Because you can take out that big one, that big one, whatever it's called. No! 
Don't let him get away! There's nothing we can do. They're gone. Half the colony's in there. They took Egan and Sam and, and Lilith. Do something! I didn't want it to end this way. I did what I could. More than most, Shepard. Shepard? Wait. I know that name. Sure, I remember you. You're some type of big alliance hero. Commander Shepard, captain of the Normandy, the first human specter, savior of the Citadel. You're in the presence of a god, Delan, back from the dead. All the good people we lost and you get left behind. Figures. Screw this. I'm done with you alliance types. I thought you were dead, Shepard. We all did. It's been too long, Ash. How have you been? That's it? You show up after two years and act like nothing's happened? We had something, Shepard. Something real. I... I loved you. I thought you were dead. I almost... How could you put me through that? Why didn't you try to contact me? Why didn't you let me know you were alive? I'm sorry, Ash. I was clinically dead. It took two years to bring me back. So much time has passed. You've moved on. I don't want to reopen old wounds. I moved on. But here you are, pulling me back in. And now we've got reports about you and Cerberus. Reports? You mean you already knew? Alliance Intel said Cerberus could be behind our missing colonies. We got a tip that this one could be the next to get hit. I went to Anderson, but he wouldn't talk. But there were rumors that you weren't dead. Worse, that you were working for the enemy. Cerberus and I want the same thing, to save our colonies. That doesn't mean I answer to them. Do you really believe that? Or is that just what Cerberus wants you to think? I wanted to believe that you were alive. I just never expected anything like this. How could you just turn your back on all of us? You betrayed the Alliance. Anderson, you betrayed me. Ash, you know me. You know I'd only do this for the right reason. You saw it yourself. The Collectors are targeting human colonies, and they're working with the Reapers. I'd like to believe you, Shepard, but I don't trust Cerberus. And it worries me that you do. What did they do to you? What if they're behind it? What if they're the ones working with the Collectors? Damn it, Williams. You're so focused on Cerberus that you're ignoring the real threat. You're letting how you feel about their history get in the way of facts. Or maybe you feel like you owe Cerberus because they saved you. Maybe it's you. Doesn't matter. I still know where my loyalties lie. I'm an Alliance soldier. It's in my blood. I'm reporting back to the Citadel. I'll let them decide if they believe your story. I could use someone like you and my crew, Ash. It'll be just like old times. No, it won't. I'm no fan of aliens, but Cerberus has a history of being extremist. I'll never work for a group like that. Goodbye, Shepard. Just try to be careful. Joker, send the shuttle to pick us up. I've had enough of this colony. All right, so we got a couple of upgrades in the collector particle beam. Out of that, and we leveled up too, but. That's just a small thing, so... <clears throat> I don't know why. It says some research benefits... I'll have to say in a second. Shepard, good work on Horizon. Hopefully the Collectors will think twice before attacking another colony. It's not a victory. We interrupted the Collectors, but they still abducted half the colony. That's better than an entire colony, and more than we've accomplished since the abductions began. The Collectors will be more careful now, but I think we can find another way to lure them in. Ash said the Alliance got a tip about me and Cerberus. Is that you? I may have let it slip that you were alive, and with Cerberus. 
You risked the lives of my friend, my crew, and that entire colony just to lure the collectors there? A calculated risk. I suspected the collectors were looking for you or people connected to you. Now I know for certain. I told you I wouldn't sit and wait while the Reapers and collectors gather strength. Besides, they would have hit another colony eventually, and without a way to predict which one, they would have abducted everyone. We have to make sure they don't abduct anyone else. I want the Collector stopped for that very reason. That's why we're doing this, Shepard. I'm devoting all resources to finding a way through the Omega-4 Relay. We have to hit them where they live. Your team will need to be strong, as will their resolve. There's no looking back. The same goes for you. Can I assume you've put your past relationships behind you? None of your damn business. If it affects the mission, better you should leave it behind. Shepard, once you find a way through the Omega-4 relay to the Collector homeworld, there's no guarantee you'll return. To have any hope of surviving, you and your entire team must be fully committed to this. Let me worry about them. You just find us a way to the Collector homeworld. I just want to be upfront about your odds. You'll need everyone at their best. I've forwarded three more dossiers. Keep building your team while I find a way through the relay. And be careful, Shepard. The Collectors will be watching you. I guess we're really gonna do it. Hit the Omega-4 Relay. Take the fight to the Collectors in person. Looking forward to the action. After seeing what those bastards did on Horizon, though, it makes you think. They're powerful, but we've got a few tricks for them. If anyone can stop them, we can. No argument there, Commander. Horizon just made it hit home. What we're doing, what we're up against. Gonna go take care of a little unfinished business. I imagine everyone else is, too. Getting some closure, you know? Hey, guy. So we got more dossiers, and we want to talk to everyone. Biotic damage or biotic duration, heavy skin weave, or heavy bone weave. There we go. Shepard, how can I help? Have you got a minute to talk? Some other time. About to test new bioweapon. Not on us, of course. Didn't think I had to specify, but Joker got nervous. Anything else? I'll let you work. We'll be here if you need me. Commander, sorry I'm a little unfocused. Personal matter. It won't affect my duties. Always have time for my crew. What is it? As I said, it's a personal matter. I don't want to waste our time if it turns out to be a goose chase. But... Well, I got pinged by a ghost the other night. Family. I'm listening. My private log got an update about the Hugo Gerns back, the ship my father served on. It sent an SOS last week, reporting a crash and requesting a rescue. Shepard, that ship went missing ten years ago. I hadn't talked to my father for three years before that. I've buried everything but a body. Now, I'm not convinced it isn't just some automated distress signal ticking over. It's been too long. I think you'd be more excited that your father might be alive. He wasn't around enough for me to have bad memories. It's an old, well-healed wound. But if he's actually alive and needs help, I also want to note that it's not normal procedure for distress calls to be routed to the Normandy. This was passed to my personal log through Cerberus filters. I think we can spare the time. Pass the coordinates to Joker. I appreciate that, Commander. I don't expect more than dusty old bones, but... It'll be good to close the record. Okay. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. I saw the reports on Horizon, Commander. What you did was amazing. The report mentioned that Ashley Williams was there. How did that go? 
There's not much to say. The past is the past. I understand. Anyway, how may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? You have unread messages at your private terminal. Operative Lawson would like to see you at her station on the crew deck. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Incoming message from Admiral Stephen Hack at Alliance HQ. Commander Shepard, I need to discuss a sensitive matter with you privately. I'll take this in my quarters. Call me. Just this morning, I received word that the Batarians arrested her. They're holding her in a secret prison outpost on terrorism charges. I need you to infiltrate the prison and get her out of there. As a favor to me, I'm asking you to go in alone. I'll make this a priority. The prison is hidden underground in a Batarian outpost in Aratat. I'll upload the coordinates now. Once she's secure, confirm her discovery. We'll debrief you when you're back. Got it. Hack it out. Feed the fish. Nope, wrong one. There we go. Here's another stupid message. Jorben, he's the one that um, we scan the keepers for. He's telling us, oh, they were the first uh, beings in the Citadel. And they were uh, bioengineered. Okay. He talked to Miranda. Ooh, shit. I don't know why I'm snag on tired. Shepard, I find myself in the unpleasant position of asking for your help. I don't like discussing personal matters, but this is important. Miranda, you're one of my crew. Tell me what's on your mind. You remember what I told you about father? Building a dynasty? There was another reason I went to Cerberus for protection. I have a sister, a twin, and he's still hunting her. Cerberus has kept her safe until now. She's living a normal life on Ilium, safe and hidden from my father. So you think your father has tracked her down? Precisely, Commander. My sources indicate he knows that she's on Ilium. I've tried to keep her hidden without impacting her life, but I'm out of options. He's too close. I need to relocate my sister's family before it's too late. What do you need me to do? My father is extremely persistent. I'd like to go to Ilium when Cerberus is moving the family to make sure none of his agents get too close. My contact's name is Lantea. She'll be waiting for us in the lounge near the Nurse Astra docking bay. Okay. And Garrison Morden will want to talk too, I bet, here in a second, won't they? No, they won't. We're going to check out this system here. I mean, I know I don't need the um, resources, but I'm going to do it anyway, because... Probe launched. Probe 
you never know, you know. Probe launched. Launching probe. There we go. Okay. So. There it is. Like, where's the arrival one? There we go, and there it is. God, that one's a small planet. You could barely see it. Probe away. I know there's another planet here. There it was. Sometimes this game glitches and you gotta exit the galaxy map and go back in just to be able to leave the planet. There we go. Okay, what do I want to do here? We'll do disruptor. And we'll do heavy. We don't want to give squad. I never do squad. There we go. Okay. See if I can do this without being caught. This place is run down, even for a prison.
get the human in question. Get your hands off me! There we go. Why waste the ammo when you can use your melee attacks, you know? Heavy weapon ammo, I'll take that. Okay, let's see if I can find it now without getting lost. Okay, and then it's up the stairs. That's right. That's right. It's up the stairs. Okay, we'll take that, that. Drop that down. And we go in here.
Okay. And we did it without getting caught. Look at that. Who are you? What are you doing? Dr. Kenson, I'm Commander Shepard. I'm here to get you out. Commander Shepard? I'd heard you were alive. Hackett must have received my message. We're not safe here. Can you walk? Fine. Just give me a moment. We have to go. Now. If we can find a console, I can hack security. Make us an escape path. Then we'll find one. Go. Ready. Got your ass too. All right, cool. Get over here to the security console. They know we're here. Keep them off me while I hack us a way out. Do everything we can to keep them off. Okay, sniper rifle's not gonna work. We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. They're coming through that door in the back. Lock it down. Okay, yeah, I'm out of position here. Yep. We need to close the door. We can't. Yep, I was way out of position. They're coming through that door in the back. Look I understand that. Okay, I can't fucking shoot and fucking run to that door at the same fucking time. What do you want me to fucking do? Fucking A. They're coming up from below. Other side, go. Okay. Again, we're out of position. We're out of position. We're out of position. Yeah, see, I... This is what I can't stand in this fucking mission. This is what I can't stand. Stupid shit like this. You gotta fucking protect her, and then you gotta do a bunch of bullshit just to keep... Just to keep them from fucking killing her. 
This drives me in fucking insane. You don't get a good fucking spot to take cover. You don't. See, you, you can't take fucking cover. You just can't. You gotta run, 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 run. We need to close the door we came in through. Keep them out. Okay, that's the problem. I can't get to it. Lock it down. Shut up. Okay, just shut up. Ugh. Bastards. They're coming up from below. Other side, go. Need more time. There. Bringing down their orbital tracking network. the other side more enemies on the elevators up to the hangar. I'll bring it down to us. Almost done. That did it. Let's move. Thank you, Jesus. Open the old fashioned way. Leave that to me. They're here. Enemy down. Fire. Okay, go away. God damn it. That's when you think they're all fucking dead. No! They got even fucking more! God damn it. Fucking hate this shit. Enemies all over the fucking place and you can't fucking... 
There. You're trying to get something done and can't. There. Autopilot. We should be well out of range before they get their security measures unscrambled. Do you think they'll come after you? I'm not taking any chances. Batarians don't take kindly to humans who plan to destroy their mass relays. So the charges against you are true? Well, to be fair, that's about half the story. My people and I were here investigating rumors of Reaper technology out in the fringes of this system. I guess you found something. We found proof that the Reapers will be arriving in this system. When they get here, they'll use its mass relay to travel throughout the galaxy. We call it the Alpha Relay. From here, the Reapers can invade anywhere in the galaxy. So you decided to destroy it? Exactly. Doing that would stop the Reapers' invasion. Even at FTL speeds, it'd be months or years before they got to the next relay. We came up with what we just called the Project. A plan to launch a nearby asteroid into the relay and destroy it before the Reapers could arrive. Of course, the resulting explosion would probably wipe out the system. I still don't see how you learned about this supposed invasion. The evidence came from what we call Object Row, a Reaper artifact we discovered among the asteroids near the relay itself. When we get back to Arcturus Station, I'll explain everything and provide copies of all our notes on the artifact. The stakes are too high. If you were willing to destroy a whole system over this, I want to see your proof. I guess I can't argue with that. Give me a moment. Kenson to Project Base. Prepare your voice, Doctor. You coming home? Affirmative. And I've got Commander Shepard with me. Shepard? Really? Tidy up the lab. The commander needs to confirm the artifact. Right. I'll get everything set up for your arrival. Uh, project base out. All set. Just sit back and relax. We'll be there in no time. Welcome to Project Base. What's this? That's our countdown to arrival. When that gets to zero, the Reapers will have come. Just over two days and counting. Puts things in perspective, doesn't it? How do you know that's an accurate countdown? It is. The artifact has been giving off pulses at definite intervals since we found it. The intervals have been decreasing at a steady rate. The artifact is reacting to the Reapers' proximity. In just over 48 hours, the pulses will become constant, and the Reapers will be here. You're saying the Reapers could be at Earth in two days? There's no time to waste. Then let's show you that proof. That door exits the hangar. The artifact is in our central lab area. Go through the door at the end of that corridor to your left. So what would it take to get the project back up and running? Everything was in place when we were arrested. It wasn't a question of could we, but should we? What alternative do we have? The Reapers will reach this system regardless. But the Alpha Relay is their shortcut to the rest of the galaxy. 
If you want to keep the Reapers at bay, this relay must be destroyed. We have to get the project running again. It's probably the only chance we have. One sec, let me get the door. Commander Shepard, I give you Object Row. You have the Reaper artifact just sitting here? Out in the open? When we found it, it showed me a vision of the Reaper's arrival. Kenson, this is not good. Give it a moment, Shepard. It'll give you the proof you need. you start the project, Shepard. I can't let you stop the arrival. So you really gotta move around a lot. You can't, you can't stay in one spot. That'll what? That's what get you killed. Down, Shepard. All right, particle beam. Boom, bitch.
There, that really helped. Getting that, the head off that mech. There we go, we got it. We made it. We made it through all five waves. Sure, it take, took me a little meta gel, but at least I got it, so. You don't have to make it through all five waves, but I do it anyway, because it's just fun to do. God, these guns suck. There we go. There we go. We'll take those salvage. 
Nothing up here. Come on. There we go. Nothing. Come on, man. They don't hide anything. Kiss is acting strange lately. Like she doesn't care about the project anymore. And I know I'm not the only one having those dreams. The Reapers are coming, she says. But I'm not sure if I'm hearing fear or hope in her voice. They've seen her. There we go, shit. Get rid of you. Yeah, these guys I cannot do, do with a sniper rifle. They're too fast. As much as I'd love to, I can't. But it looks like I'm not going to have a choice. God, his ass. There we go. Eat the meta gel. There it is. Okay. Welcome to Project Control. I want to activate the project. Warning. Activating the project will result in an estimated 305,000 casualties. Do you wish to continue? Thank you. 
progress. Warning, collision with mass relay is imminent. Begin evacuation procedures. Alert, all colonists living in the Bahak system. This is- Shepard, no, do you have any idea what you've done? You leave me no choice. If we can't stop this asteroid, it must be destroyed. Tell me where to find Dr. Amanda Kenson. Dr. Kenson is traveling to the reactor core module. An ESO core meltdown should do it. Because of you, everyone on this rock will be obliterated. Not if I get to you first. Yet. There. Don't try to stop me, Shepard. I have to do this. I've already activated the project. We can still escape this rock. There is no escape. There's no redemption for what you've done. I will die, never having seen the Reaper's blessings. And you will just die. Damn it, Kenson. I had him scoped. There we go. Keep him in there. Safety protocols disengaged. Core temperature rising. Yet. Boom! There! How do I stabilize the reactor core? All automatic safety protocols have been overwritten. To stabilize the reactor core, manually insert cooling rod A from this control station. Manually insert cooling rod B from control station B. Doing so will stabilize the reactor core. Get you first, hell yeah. There we go. I had you yeah. I had you scoped. Oh. 
Oh, come on. That was... That was a hit. That was a hit. Tell me it wasn't. <laughs> Bullshit! That was a fucking headshot! Jesus. Okay, there it is. Ah! There we go. Yeah. Reactor temperature approaching critical. Okay, it's the elevator. That's where we go. Okay, here we go. Step away from the reactor. You've ruined everything. I can't hear the whispers anymore. Turn around. 
Now! You've taken them away from me. I will never see the Weeper's arrival. All you had to do was... Warning. Collision imminent. 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 Joker, this is Shepard. I need a pickup. Now. Communication system damaged. Damn it. Evacuation protocols in effect. All personnel report to escape shuttles. Where can I find an escape shuttle? Take the lift from this room to the external access. From there, proceed to the communications tower. The remaining escape shuttles will be located on the tower's landing pad. I have to get to that comm tower and take a shuttle. It's my only chance. Okay. There it is. Okay, here we go. External comm channel open. Shepard to Normandy. Joker, do you read me? Shepard, you have become an annoyance. You fight against inevitability, dust struggling against cosmic winds. This seems a victory to you, a star system sacrificed. But even now, your greatest civilizations are doomed to fall. Your leaders will beg to be harvested. Maybe you're right. Maybe we can't win this. But we'll fight you regardless. Just like we did Sovereign. Just like I'm doing now. However insignificant we might be. We will fight. We will sacrifice. And we will find a way. That's what humans do. 
Know this as you die in vain. Your time will come. Your species will fall. Prepare yourselves for the arrival. Commander Shepard, Normandy inbound for pickup. Roger that. Here we go! The last use of this relay before it gets destroyed. like you've recovered. Admiral Hackett. Sounds like you went through hell down there. How are you feeling? Fine. No more visions, if that's what you mean. I wasn't expecting to see you here. You went out there as a favor to me. I decided to debrief you in person. That was before the mass relay exploded and destroyed an entire Batarian system. What the hell happened out there, Commander? I confirmed Dr. Kenson's proof. The Reapers were coming, and destroying that relay was the only way to stop them. Kenson sedated me for almost two days. I started the engines with little more than an hour left. I tried to warn the Batarian colony, but time ran out. The Batarians report no survivors from Aratat. At least you tried. And you believe the Reaper invasion really was a threat? No doubt about it. We literally had minutes to spare. I'm sure all the details are in your report. I won't lie to you, Shepard. The Batarians will want blood, and there's just enough evidence for a witch hunt. And we don't want war with the Batarians. Not with the Collectors out there taking our colonists. What are you saying? You did what you did for the best of reasons, but... There were more than 300,000 Batarians in that system. All dead. They died to save trillions of lives. If I could have saved them, you bet your ass I would have. You're preaching to the choir, Commander. If it were up to me, I'd give you a damn medal. Unfortunately, not everyone will see it that way. So what do you suggest? Evidence against you is shoddy at best. But at some point, you'll have to go to Earth and face the music. I can't stop it. But I can and will make them fight for it. I'll gladly stand trial once this mission is done. Glad to see working with Cerberus hasn't stripped away your sense of honor. Do whatever you have to do out here. But when Earth calls, you make sure you're there with your dress blues on. Ready to take the hit. In the meantime, you keep this. I don't need to see a report to know you did the right thing. Yes, sir. You've done a hell of a thing, Commander. Okay. 
So we got that one done, even though I died once, but that's okay. That's okay. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. We'll take a look upstairs once I feed the fish. Oh, Ashley, um, emailed us. I, I haven't read this one. Okay, so Ashley still has feelings for Shepard. <laughs> cool. Have the weapon, Medigel. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Morden would like to speak with you over in his tech lab. Jack would like to see you down in her hidey hole on the engineering deck. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Okay, so we need to talk to Morden and Jack. Shepard, important news. Know you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Too important to wait. Just receiving data. Still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You remember our talk? My work on genophage modification? You stopped the Krogan adaptation to the genophage. Part of a team. Scientists, all different types. Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member. Malin, last seen on Tuchanka, might torture him, make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. Do you think they found out your team updated the genophage? Unclear. No way to determine until we get to Tuchanka. We'll go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pack. Talk to them or Clan Chief. Okay. Now, we're gonna go down to speak to Jack. And we'll talk to Grunt too and see how he's doing. We need to bring him out. So we can talk to him about his upgrade too now that I'm thinking about it. I got thoughts like little bugs crawling in and out of my head. I can't stop them. You know I have a history with Cerberus. You know how far back it goes. I'll listen to anything you have to say, Jack. Your pal, the elusive man? Never seen him before, but Cerberus raised me. First thing I remember is my cell door in a Cerberus base. They did experiments, drugged me, tortured me. Whatever chance I had to be normal, they stole it by trying to turn me into some superbiotic. The doctors, the other kids, every one of them hated me. They let me suffer. You're absolutely certain that Cerberus was running the facility. I was a kid, but I wasn't dumb. I know how to listen. It was Cerberus. Don't care how far down the chain it was. They thought they were so clever. Turns out, mess with someone's head enough and you can turn a scared kid into an all-powerful bitch. Fucking idiots. 
I'm gonna talk to the elusive man, and he'd better have some answers. He'll just deny everything. That's not what I'm after anyway. I found the coordinates in your files. I want to go to the Telton facility on Pragya, where they tortured and drugged me. I want to go to the center of the place, my cell. I want to deploy a big fucking bomb, and I want to watch from orbit when it goes. I'll set a course for Pragya. I owe you, Shepard. Okay. And like I said, we need to talk to Grunt. Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. The hold is too open, not enough cover. Armor is limited. Warlord Granth would target here to scatter heavy cargo, then focus on engines. That's what tank imprints show about human ships anyway. It's how I learned from the tank. Old pictures where memory is. Like holding a book for a child. Just remember this picture after picture. No help with finding a reason to care. What other human info was floating around in there? Less than a finger deep to sever your spine. You're soft. Salarian, Sasari, all soft. Quarians, not so much. Turians, you have to work the blade, I guess. Don't see much point to it, though. <laughs> much point. <laughs> uh, never mind. Something must move you. You're as genetically Krogan as you can get. I see suffering, the dead, and I think weak. I'm supposed to be strong. My guts were grown from thousands more worthy. The dead were weak. If they were strong, I wouldn't be needed. I don't know why Okir started teaching. When he turned on the tank the first time, I screamed. Weak. Pitiful. So you started small, but you became what you are. Not everyone gets that chance. I'm built for strength, but didn't earn it. I just am. Those dead were strong enough to try, even if they lost. The perfect Krogan, ignoring what made me. No strength in that. I'll take another look at what happened to the Krogan. Find a reason to care about it. Shepard. Anything in your tank imprints that can make use of the resources we found? Hmm. Might have something I could put together. Don't know how useful it will be. Rogan shotgun. Grunt gets his own shotgun. Okay. We're gonna do one more mission. We're gonna do one more mission. Um, we're gonna help Jacob, I think. How may I help you, Commander? Is there anything I should know? Nothing right now. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. Take care. Okay. There he is. Yeah, I'm gonna do one more mission, then it'll be lunchtime for me, so. Got an anomaly here. Launching probe. Something on our sensors. Oh, we got some blue suns here. Get incinerary ammo maxed. 
for Inferno ammo. And that'll be good for shotgun right there. Because what um, Inferno ammo does, it um, it's an explosive charge that spreads through the ammunition's payload on impact, pot potentially igniting the target and all nearby enemies. What it does is when it hits an enemy, there's an explosion radius. It's good for shotguns. Oh, uh, we're going to wait and do armor piercing rounds for Garrus. We're going to do a Krogan Pure Blood, so. Um. Grunt is hard to kill. Okay. And then we're going to hold off. So we can max out his fortification when we're ready. Alright. I didn't give him his claymore, did I? That's okay. Go away. There you go. There we go. Sometimes I question the hit detection on this. Oh, 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 what a shot that one was. So pretty much um, Exo Jenny was working with um, the Blue Suns and they wanted to make a deal with the Blue Suns.
Get out of the way. Stay down, bitch. I don't know why it's so much fun getting headshots in this game, but it is. It's so much fun. It's so satisfying. It is so satisfying to get the headshots. So there's a derelict ship we need to capture for this quest. Which we'll go ahead and do that next. Okay, so Exo Jenny found a Prothean artifact. Um, they wanted the Blue Suns to help defend it, and Santiago wanted half the profit from it. So Cerberus Command tells us exactly where they're at, and so we're going to go deal with them. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. No, we well we did, but we don't have it now, so. Eh. Grunt seems very agitated. You may want to check in on him. Okay. We want to get all these missions open. That way, then, um, they're ready to go. I'm not going to go to Chachunka right away. I'm going to uh, do these side quests first. That way, I can get money. Because Tachunka is a um, hub world. Chamber said you're tearing up the place. Something wrong? Something is wrong, Shepard. I feel wrong. Tense. I just want to kill something with my hands. More so than usual. Like it's not my choice. Like I just want to... I don't know. See? Why do that? What's wrong? Okir didn't imprint anything to help you figure this out? I see pictures of old battles. Voices of warlords. But this is a blood haze in my head. I want control. When we're moving, fighting, I focus. But here, my blood screams, my plates itch. And even you are just noise. I'm tank-born. What is this? Edie, anything in your files about Krogan diseases that could cause this? Cerberus has a number of autopsies on file, but nothing on a living Krogan of this age and situation. Krogan are reluctant to share medical records. My people were defeated by doctors and labs. They will never let stuff like that leave the homeworld to Chunka. Joker can get us to the Krogan homeworld. I need everyone at their best. Thank you, Shepard. I don't like this. Fury is my choice, not a sickness. Okay. Okay, we got another planet we need to look for, which is right by the fuel depot. All right. Launching probe. 
Now we gotta deal with that there like ship. And then I'll call it for this video after that. Okay, we're going to board the ship. We're going to steal the stuff on said ship. <laughs> All right. Warp for you. We'll do unstable warp because what it does, it increases the blast radius when warp detonates biotic effects. So it, it's really nice to have a um, radius. And for Grunt, we need to put on his um, Claymore. Not that heavy out of the way. That's how you deal with a group of freaking enemies. Just take them the, fr the fuck out, man. Hell yeah. So here they're warning, oh, there's some intruders in the cargo bay. Deal with them. What were they doing here? Oh, we will in a minute. There has to be a way in. There is it's right here. Okay. Oh, I know where we're going.
to be a way in. That did it. and scoped. There we go, you gotta hit that one. There we go. over here. We want the research data. That's it, okay. We'll take the payload. We'll get out of here. All right. We got the heavy skin we upgrade. We got more than enough stuff to upgrade it, so we'll go ahead and do that now, and then I'll just call it for this video. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Yeah, we'll deal with it next episode because I'm. It's getting to be lunchtime for me, so. Boom. Boom. All right. So that's going to be the end of this episode. So I hope you all had fun this episode. I did, even though I snapped a little bit. So I'll see you all next episode.